here with rookie Max Chilton. And Max, you come to the Indianapolis Motor Speedway for the first time a few weeks ago. What was it like for the first time as a rookie coming here? Uh, it's an amazing opportunity. It's uh, you know it's been going 100 years, and I'm fortunate enough to have my rookie mm -hmm. uh, year on the 100th running. So it's a real uh, special occasion. It's also a really special circuit. You just come through the through the tunnel, and as you come in, you've got the museum in mm -hmm. front of you, which is like a it's just a place full of history and then you, you see the size of the place and when you actually finally get to drive it you realize how special it is yeah you get on the road course last week saturday the angeles grand prix talk about that your focus through that race and now you turn your attention to the oval yeah it was really important last week obviously you had the 500 in the back of your mind but um there was plenty of race points available last weekend at the angeles list um so it was important to keep your focus try and uh, get as many points as possible we had a bit of an up and down race but you know we still came away with some points so it's not all too bad. And then uh, we got our rookie orientation out of the way um, yesterday, which was is amazing. I, I've driven the oval here b before in a lights car, but it's very different in an Indy yep. car. Talk about what you do on a rain delay like this. You know, you can never predict the weather, especially here in Indiana. Um, but just what's your approach for a day where you might only get a couple hours of track time as to six hours? Yeah, um, obviously half of half the time is probably spent looking at the radar, hoping for the, the rain to disappear. I think we might be pushed to even get an hour's running today because yeah. it looks like it's going to rain till two. Um, from the people that are experienced here, so it takes a good few hours to dry. Um, so yeah, we, we look at videos, overlays from stuff uh, from, from the day before to try and get as prepared as we can be. But half the time we're sort of just spent on social media and <laughs> seeing, else, seeing what else is going on in the world. Max Schulter, thanks for joining us here at 1070 The Fan. Pleasure.